Peace, love, and life, family, and welcome back to Moments with Mila. Welcome back. Thank you so much for taking this moment to spend with me. And most importantly, as always, thank you for dedicating these next few moments to your overall health and wellness. Now, we just finished up Full Body March last week, right? At the end of March, we finished that up. Good job to you all. Um, April, as I promised, begins the April Lower Body Challenge. Um, Things are gonna change up slightly just for this month um, because we're doing the challenge and the way the challenge is structured, uh, we do five core, five base exercises, I should say. I don't wanna confuse that with the ab or core work. We're doing five base exercises each day and every week the number of repetitions increases. So basically we're doing the exact same exercises each day of the challenge, but week one, we're gonna be doing 20 reps. Week two, 25 reps. Week three, 30 reps. And week, week uh, four, 40 reps, right? Now, of course, the same thing. Do one to two sets if you're just beginning. Do three to four sets if you're more advanced. Listen to your body always. The only difference is, well, another difference rather, I should say, um, is I'm only gonna record once a week. I'll premiere that same video more than one time a week and you can do it with me each time or save it or go, but however you wanna do it, right? But I'm personally only, only gonna do the exercise on the channel one time, okay? Um, and that's again, because it's the exact same exercise, the exact same amount of reps. Normally when we do a challenge and it increases day by day, I'll come on and do each one with you. I'm still gonna be doing them and I promise you I'm gonna be consistent. But hey, as I always say, the work works and if we say we're doing it and we're not it's going to show right it's going to show so i want you all to be consistent i think that's enough housekeeping for now so let's get started with um telling you what those and if you've been following me or if you follow me on instagram or the moments with me uh, page on um facebook you've already seen or maybe you already started on april the first that is an option i did start on april the first so you do have that option um so the five base exercises you're gonna do abductors, you can do those standing or lying down, and that's basically where you are working on your inner thigh, right? Adductors. And we're gonna be lifting. Oh, and I have one leg weight. I did share with the sisters who are in my wellness group on Facebook, um, and let me know if you wanna join. Just reach out or leave it in the comments. I will find you or you find me. Um, I have five pound weights on. You can use weights. You can also use a resistance band to add to um, your workout if you want to, but it's not required. But again, we've, we've been working out together pretty consistently since January. So I'm gonna assume, we don't like that word. I'm gonna assume that you've been doing the work so you're at a point where you're ready to add more to it. All right, that, I have talked entirely too much, but y'all know when we start something new, I wanna make sure that you're really clear. But again, if you were following me, you saw already what the breakdown was and you probably already started on April the 1st. So we're just doing it together now. The five exercises are your abductors, your leg abductors, your adductors, your RDLs that we've been doing, squats and calf raises. You don't even have to get on the floor. Do I recommend you to continue doing planks? Yes. Do I recommend you continue to doing ab work? Yes. Arm work? Yes. Why? Because we are building power 365 sisters. We are changing our lives. We are changing our bodies. We are changing to be better for our families and our communities, right? We're increasing that power. We're calling it back. All right, I'm gonna get started. I think that is enough. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna start, <clears throat> excuse me, with the leg abductors, and people sometimes they call them uh, leg raises. So um, again, if you wanna lay on your side and do them, you know, have your arm in the angle, you can do that. But for me, I'm gonna switch them up just a little bit um, next week, where we also go to the side and then go to the back. But this week, we're just gonna do it straight the way it calls for in the challenge, all right? The number is 20, let's get started. Okay, switching to the other leg, same thing, all right? Ooh, 
seems like you won't feel it just based off looking at me, but you will feel it in that hip area, all right? <clears throat> Excuse me. So next we're gonna go to the adductors where we're gonna be lifting. Now you can kind of angle your foot to the side where the inside of your foot is slightly facing the camera or facing your mirror or your television, whatever you're watching from, right? And you're literally going to lift. If you need to brace yourself and hold on to something, that's fine. It doesn't decrease the effectiveness, okay? All right, let's get started. You're lifting. Walk it out a little bit. All right, switch inside. Working your inner thighs. Okay, we're gonna get into RDLs, squats, and then the calf raises for last. It'll be a little bit easier. Now for the RDLs, <clears throat> I'm still at the point where I like to continue to use my 20 pound weight. And it's very important not to go backwards on your weights. You wanna increase, okay, as you're building power. All right, let's get started. Sit back, it's a hip motion. Straight to squats while we're feeling that burn. And I like sumo squats. You can have your legs together if you want, it's up to you. Okay? All right, let's go. Good job. All right, for the calf raises, I'm going back to my 20 pound weights. All right, we're ready. Let's finish strong. job and that's it that is it we're done and uh, I'll be adding one additional exercise on each week 
But that is it for this week. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, or you can do it Monday through Friday. Whatever works for you. Thank you again, I appreciate your time. And if you remember nothing else, absolutely nothing tastes as good as being healthy feels. Until next time.